हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू ई लर्निंग प्लेटफॉर्म ऑफ कड़ी शर्व विश्वविद्यालय टुडे वी आर गोइंग फॉर द सिलेबस ऑफ एम कॉम सेमेस्टर टू द सब्जेक्ट अकाउंटिंग फॉर मैनेजरियल डिसीजन वन दैट इज ए एम डी वन आई प्रोफेसर प्रेमल पटेल फ्रॉम श्री एच पी पटेल पोस्ट ग्रेजुएट इंस्टीट्यूट ऑफ कॉमर्स कडी लेट सी which are the points which are the units we are covered in this subject first unit number 1 introduction to management accounting and financing decision and the weightage is 20% unit number 2 that is financial statement and ratio analysis again the weightage is 20% unit number 3 that is cash flow statement weightage 20% unit number 4 earning management the weightage is 20% and unit number 5 that is working capital management again the weightage is 20% so here in this subject we learn total 5 units now basically unit number 1 it is divided into two parts that is introduction to management accounting that what is management accounting objective scope managerial decision roles and responsibility in another part that is financing decision the basic short not and definitions are there that is short term debt lines of credit long term debt mortgage bonds leases etc unit number 2 that is ratio analysis whatever in the past we have already learned the ratio analysis and their interpretations so same here we are again learn from the following points that is users of financial information which are the trends how we can present which are the transparency in unit number 3 we learn cash flow statement that is accounting standard 3 so we have already learn cash flow statement three activities are there operating investing and financing activity unit number 4 that is earning management that is company's views of managing earnings accounting standards which are the ethical behavior and cost of obtaining capital which are the factors to motivate earning management so all these things we learn in earning management and unit number 5 that is working capital management which are the principle regarding working capital management various approaches estimations of working capital components of working capital inventory and source of working capital finance this point we learn in working capital management now the paper scheme of accounting for managerial decision 1 question 1 to 5 all things here all questions carry equal marks question number 1 it is compulsory and the marks 70 so that is the scheme of accounting for managerial decision 1 that is mcom semester 2 thank you